to evaluate integrals of the form of the form first one integral 1 by a plus b cos x dx second one integral 1 by a plus b sin x dx so now working rule working rule so for one let us suppose tan x by 2 is equal to t then if you differentiate on both sides what do you get now dt by dx is equal to secant square x by 2 into x by 2 differentiation is 1 by 2. Now, if tan x by 2 is equal to t secant square x by 2 is 1 plus t square and by 2. Now, what does dx becomes dx is equal to 2 by 1 plus t square dt. Now, dx is replaced by dx in both cases replaced by 2 by 1 plus t square dt. And now, cos x, what is cos x? Cos x is 1 minus tan square x by 2 by 1 plus tan square x by 2. So, this is 1 minus t square by 1 plus t square. That means, in order to find out uh, the integral of the first one, say tan x by 2 is equal to t, put cos x is equal to 1 minus t square by 1 plus t square and replace dx is equal to 2 by 1 plus t square dt and then integrate using the known integral values. Similarly, for the second one, for the second one, same procedure, the sin x is equal to we know in terms of tan 2 tan x by 2 by 1 plus tan square x by 2. Now, this becomes 2 t by 1 plus t square. So, in the place of this, in the case of this one, in the place of sin x, replace 2 t by 1 plus t square, in the place of dx, 1 minus t square by 1 plus t square. Then, we get the known integral using the known integrate, integrating formula. So, we can find out integral of second one also. The first one, second one can be done using these kind of substitutions. So, example problem, evaluate integral dx by pi plus 4 cos x. Now, i is equal to integral 1 by 5 plus 4 cos x dx. Already as we have discussed the working rule session, put tan x by 2 is equal to t, dx is equal to 2 by 1 plus t square dt and cos x is equal to 1 minus t square by 1 plus t square. That means, if we say tan x by 2 is equal to t, cos x becomes 1 minus t square by 1 plus t square and whereas, dx becomes 2 by 1 plus t square. Let us substitute. Now, this integral i becomes now 1 by 5 plus 4 into 1 minus t square by 1 plus t square into 2 by 1 plus t square dt, 2 taken out common out. Integral 1 by 1 plus t square is the LCM, 5 plus 5 t square 
plus 4 minus 4 t square into 2 by sorry already 2 is taken out 1 by 1 plus t square dt this 1 plus t square comes up 2 integral of 1 plus t square by 5 plus 4 is 9 whereas 5 t square minus 4 t square plus t square into 1 by 1 plus t square dt this this gets cancelled. Now, what do you get? 2 times integral of 1 by 3 square plus t square dt. So, we have standard integral. Integral 1 by a square plus x square dx that is 1 by a tan inverse x by a plus constant of integration. Can we apply here? Yes, why can't we can apply here? Now, 2 times 1 by 3 tan inverse t by 3. This is 2 by 3 tan inverse of t stands for tan x by 2 by 3 plus constant of integration. Next second problem, evaluate integral of dx by 3 cos x plus 4 sin x plus 6. i is equal to integral 1 by 3 cos x plus 4 sin x plus 6 dx. Let us say this tan x by 2 is equal to t. Now, dx is equal to 2 by 1 plus t square dt, whereas cos x is equal to 1 minus t square by 1 plus t square and sin x is equal to 2t by 1 plus t square. Now, cos x is equal to 1 minus t square by 1 plus t square, sin x is equal to 2t by 1 plus t square whereas dx is equal to 2 by 1 plus t square dt if you say tan x by 2 is equal to t. So, now this i becomes integral 1 by 3 times 1 minus t square by 1 plus t square 4 times 2 t by 1 plus t square plus 6 into 2 by 1 plus t square dt. Integral 1 by 1 plus t square is the LCM. 3 minus 3 t square plus 8 t plus 6 plus 6 t square. 2 common out into 1 by 1 plus t square dt. This comes up 2 times integral of 1 plus t square by 6 t square minus 3 t square 3 t square plus 8 t plus 9 6 plus 3 9 into 1 by 1 plus t square dt. This 1 plus t square 1 plus t square gets cancelled. 
we have two integral of 1 by 3 t square plus 8 t plus 9 d t. Already we had a discussion the integrals of the form integral of 1 by a x square plus b x plus c d x. So, let us do so in the in that way. So, now 2 integral of 1 by 3 common this is t square plus 8 by 3 t plus 3 d t 1 by 3 taken out 2 by third integral of 1 by t square plus 8 by 3 t one thing you remember the coefficient of 3 is 8 by 3 multiply with 1 by 2. So, 4 by 3 that becomes add 4 by 3 whole square subtract 4 by 3 whole square 4 by 3 whole square and plus 3 minus 16 by 9 dt write down 4 by 3 whole square only this is 2 by 3 integral of 1 by first 3 terms becomes t plus 4 by 3 whole square and 27 9 into 3 27 minus 16 11 that means 11 by 9 this becomes. So, this 11 by 9 can be written root 11 by 3 whole square d t again a square plus x square formula. So, 1 by a tan inverse x by a formula 2 by 3 1 by a 1 by root 11 by 3 tan inverse t plus 4 by 3 by root 11 by 3. Now, this 3 3 gets cancelled 2 by root 11 tan inverse this is 3 t plus 4 by root 11. What does t stands for? t stands for tan x by 2. So, that means therefore, this integral is equal to therefore equal to we can write 2 by root 11 tan inverse 3 tan x by 2 plus 4 by root 11 plus constant of integration.